What is your favorite episode of Pancom Podcast? Uh, that's a good question. That's tough because we've had 64 episodes. Yeah. And by the way, I'm not going to say who asked them because it wasn't, we never stipulated that we'd let people know. So I don't want to know. I don't want to know who asked There these, you go. That's yeah, probably for the crazy most. questions. You know, the episode with Norman was obviously a big deal for me. I mean, the guy's like a mentor, culinary godfather type for me. So I thought that uh, I had the opportunity to thank him for a lot of things that he did for me, which was great. You know, I always loved talking to Kush. I thought that was a very good episode. The The episode with uh, Rosa Maria was incredible. Yep. Um. You got to pick one though. This is a I have question. to I have this is to pick which one. Which is your favorite? My favorite. Episode. Remember, it's not the best. It's just your favorite. It's, yeah, that's that's true. It, it doesn't have to be the best. It's my I, you know, it's crazy cuz I don't remember all the people that we've talked to. I think I think it's easy. I just the one that I had the most fun with okay. that I I don't even remember was Falco. John Falco. And and it's cuz I actually had dinner with Falco 2 days ago and we just talked about I saw a how picture. much yeah, you how were much in yeah, shape. Yeah. I actually wasn't in rough. I was the only person at that table not in rough shape. I was just full. But um, the fact that it was so much fun and it was such a shit day and we just had like – we got super hammered um, and we – you know, it was a great conversation. I sent Nick a text. I said, hey, man, are we still on for tonight? No stress if no. I was like <laughs> – I totally didn't want to fucking come. And Nick sent me this, all one word, no spaces, with an exclamation point. Yes, sir! Yeah, there it is. And I was like, fuck. I think that was one of, that was definitely my favorite of the year. Good stuff. So John Falco, favorite guest ever. He's episode. still a jerk, though. Can I tell you a funny story about Falco? Sure. When we were at dinner the other day, uh, one of the people at the table turns around to a, a table behind us and said, listen. If you had to guess what everyone at this table does for a living, can you please tell me? And the table was like, sure. Okay. Looked at Kush, said, you're, you're a cop. I said, okay. And I was like, well, that's good. You look like the cop for yeah, training day. Yes, cop so good. And then I looked at Falco and was like, you look like you're on the geek squad at Best Buy. <laughs> I lost my shit. I, I don't know if I see it, but I saw it. And I thought it was... It was excellent, and it was it was very good. What did they say about you? That I look like I sell drugs. Sure. Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's the one dread. It's the exhibit look right now, yeah. apparently. Yeah. <laughs> hey, yo, I heard you like podcasts, so we put a podcast on your podcast so you That's can podcast. That's what I do. That's what I do. Pimp your podcast. That thump you just heard, that was my pen ass hitting the bottom of the table. <laughs> now on 1210 The Man, John Berg's pen ass hits yeah. the bottom of the table. That's going to be our 1210 The Man promo on like every episode. <laughs> that was fantastic.